Hello and welcome back to Best Notes tutorial and today's topic is the Lord of the Flies and in this video I have 30 works for you uh, these are the short notes and you can call it summary as well and uh, as you can see uh, these are pinpoints and everywhere you will find the keyboards uh, so let's start Lord of Flies for today uh, background of this story global war leads to the plane crash Stranding boys in an island on an island boys are from society valuing order and civilization So a global war Okay, uh, time ka hai yahan pe kuch bachche hote hai jo ki ka uh, Jo crash ho jata plane crash ho jata hai aur wahan par bachche kisi ek island par uh, Fuzz jate hai alright so this is the story from here the story begins uh, It starts boys gather on beach shocked and confused uh, decision point do we have an adult in charge so they didn't have anyone and they proceed to next step Ab yahan par unke saath mein koi bhi bada ya adult nahi hota hai adult figure uh, establishes order potentially impacting the entire plot but yahan pe jo adult figure hai unke saath mein nahi hai they don't have any adult in uh, in, in charge elect an, uh, elect a leader so here there are two people uh, two boys, uh, Ralph and Jack. Okay, so Ralph is uh, elected and Count, Count shall becomes a symbol of authority. So here uh, questions is asked several times like what is the single uh, symbol of uh, authority representing order and reason. So Count is symbol of authority and order and reason. Remember this thing. Jack is not elected so power struggle ensues because uh, now he wanted to become uh, you know leader impacting group dynamics negatively and the second condition elected leader yes so this happens and when we say no so chaos and infighting erupt delaying attempt at organization so they they try to organize several things there and we will talk about later so first thing was here with uh, with leader ralph when uh, ralph was a leader they established some rules there a signal fire to attract rescue they wanted to get rescued by people assembly at couch call for group discussion okay so couch is very important in this story conflict arises uh, because jack wanted to become leader too jack passionate hunter prioritizing hunting over maintaining the signal fire jeopardizing uh, rescue chances so here uh, Jack started uh, you know uh, uh, he he tried to uh, prioritize hunting here all right and uh, his Ralph's uh, the first uh, and his priority was to re to get rescue so this was the difference between Jack and Ralph rising action loss of innocence now the stories uh, Ralph, uh, rising action is during Frenchy's dance, Simon faints and uh, Simon is a uh, character here. A boy faints due to epilepsy. Boy is fueled by fear and superstition mistake him for the beast. So they, th they thought that uh, Simon is a beast and they brutally kill Simon in more Frenchy, marking a turning point towards the savagery. This is the rising action, loss of innocence in the story, fear and suspicion. Uh, Simon's death creates further fractions within the group and fostering dist uh, distrust and suspicion. Symbol of order shattered piggies uh, representing reason and logic uh, lo loses his glasses during the chaos. Now here the another character is Piggy and uh, he had uh, the glasses and he lost them. This uh, symbolizes the diminishing influence of order reason within the group. Now, climax of this work is Piggy representing order and reason is brutally murdered by Jack and his hunters. The event signifies the complete descent into savagery and triumph of chaos. Falling action of the work. Uh, here, Jack's hunters consumed by violence hunt Ralph relentlessly. Uh, so, they wanted to hunt Ralph now. The island is engulfed in flame, uh, uh, flames symbolizing the destruction of innocence and potential for good. Now, resolution. A naval officer, uh, at the end of the story, a naval officer arrives, rescues the sole survivor, 
uh, Ralph, the officer representing civilization, the witness the island's devastation. Ralph, uh, overwhelmed by the experience, breaks down in tears. This final scene reflects the lasting impact of the uh, of the events, highlighting the potential for darkness and savagery within human nature. The story ends with sense of loss and a stark reminder of the fragile nature of civilization. So if you want to get uh, all the notes for UGC NET, TGT or PZT, you can WhatsApp me on this number and you can get uh, the PDFs. Here PDF notes and even video notes for TGT, PZT. And for UGC NET, we have only PDF notes. The so, uh, second work is Dr. Foster's. We will be doing discussion with uh, the next is Pamela by Samuel Richardson. Here you can see the short notes and uh, these are revision uh, revision notes and you can uh, revise your 30 works in just uh, one hour if you are reading all these. So there are 90, 90 pages, there are 30 so you can, so you, can uh, you know divide like 3 pages uh, per work. So these are short notes but these notes includes all the important uh, points which will be important for your exams like Gulliver's travels and other works uh, I will also give you a list if you wish to uh, you know have uh, the the notes and you wish to prepare with us you can go for you know whatsapp number this is the whatsapp number you can contact and see you there until then goodbye take care